This is Hachi. I, do, I almost said Hitachi, and that's not a dog. This is a dog's tale. It's a story about a dog. And I'm so freaking excited because we we love dogs. Now I don't care what anyone says. We as a as a world of humans collectively we love dogs and i'm really hoping that it's going to be like a homeward bound type movie where the animals all talk and it's the dog and it talks and we're going to learn its stories and the dog is called hachi not hitachi i'm glad we cleared that up if you like this video please give it a great big thumbs up if you're planning to stay and you haven't already then please subscribe to all the fun stuff to make channel grow and i will love you forever I almost did it. Oh, big fat shout outs. These guys are our top tier patrons and they are Sylvia, Silent Wolf 62, Nathan Wolf, Robert McGregor, Adam Mantis, Brian Madden, Dark Calico, Jack, Len Anaquad, Wayne Cryker, Robert Edmund, Celeste McAllister, Rob Jones, Ragnar Mersh, Alonzo Torres, Bill Bryant, Chase Bauer, A Thousandth Ghost, Roger Freeman, Lee Pittman and Eric Bonham. Patchy, A Dog's Tale and Play. And because of him, we get Columbus Day off of school. <laughs> well, that's not, Oh, Richard Ke oh. That's not a good enough reason to have a hero because you get a day off school. <laughs> Just so you know, I'm not a great fan of Richard Gere, but I'm willing to give him a chance. One called Hachi a mystery dog because they never really knew where he came from. Oh, like the gremlins. But no matter how, Hachi was lost. And he was your granddad's dog, was. Oh, we're not going to see the dog. This is just going to be the story of the dog. There's the dog. Oh, 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 you're beautiful. I love him already. I have a butterfinger and I think this is the first time I've ever tried one and I don't know if I'm going to be able to eat this like a lady. I might just have to chomp. Okay, that's a lot crunchier than I thought it would be. Mmm. Oh, that is yummy. Hachi appeared at the train station. And that's where their story began. Okay, I need a bite. I need another bite. This is delicious. I'm really sorry. It's too crunchy. I need to get out of his cage. Mmm. He's a strong doggy. What kind of breed is that? He's gorgeous. Hey, buddy. He chose you. If they're not here, I'll, I'll, I'll lock him in here and he'll be safe for the night, but... Aw, uh, uh. oh, take him home. Yay! Although we knew that was going to happen. That's an amazing house. How come every American house is massive? I have a little surprise. Might have a little surprise for you too. Her surprise is not better. <laughs> Especially if it involves hamsters or gerbils or guinea pigs. I don't remember. Jump. We had an agreement. No, no. Or did you forget? No, I didn't forget. It's just for the night. Calm down. You just thought you'd bring him home and talk me into keeping him, no, right? No, I don't want to keep him. I don't. Well, she's a little bit heartless. I would do exactly the same. I would take every dog I find home with me. Them all. That's better. He's such a good little dog. He's not even crying. You know, you're the one who should be in the doghouse. Uh, she just said he should be in the doghouse. He did nothing wrong. He's been a decent human being, unlike you. Does he have a name yet? Yes, he does. Temporary guest. Oh, wished. Go someone slap her, please. Hachiko. Hachiko. He's cute. That'll help with adoption, but um, we give him two weeks. Oh, what? What? Two weeks. <laughs> We're packed. Oh, my. And then what? Don't you dare tell me what I think you mean after two weeks, because I would kick your ass. I would come down there and kick your ass every day puppy like that. What do you think, Antonia? New roommate? <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> Antonia's a little bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just face it, you're gonna keep him. Don't listen to your wife. 
Uh -huh. Hey, what have you got there? Oh, yeah, new friend here. Oh, I give all men full permission not to listen to their wife if they take a puppy home, even if they're allergic. Every day you have to walk him, feed him, clean him, pick up the poop. How many of these can I have? Here? But you get to love him. Any news? No, nobody uh, came, nobody showed up, nobody called, nobody. Wait, well, it was a monk, wasn't it? And then what, where did the monk go? Oh, no, he was sending it to someone. Who did he send it to? Or did he mean for him to get lost and end up in the loving arms of Richard Gere? Professor, no dogs on the train. No dogs on the train. Professor. Professor of music. Are you taking him to um, music school? <laughs> Don't you dare. Don't you dare say a word. <laughs> and he's out. He's away to cause havoc. Does nobody see him? He's gonna poop on the floor and then the ballerinas are gonna slip on it. Smell in my heart. Akita, or Akita, as you say. It's a very special breed. Yeah. Akita. Akita. Hachi. What? It's a Japanese for eight, number of good fortune. Yeah, so he was let out on purpose. Whether you found him or he found you, who's to say? It's meant to be. You found each other. Someone's gonna claim Hachi. Who's Hachi? That's what was on his collar, that's the symbol. You named him? He was already named! Shut the hell up! I don't want to keep him! I'm admit, it, admit it, you do. You want I to keep him? I wasn't even thinking about yes. it. Yes. I don't like you. Oh no! <gasps> what is that? Oh god, Parker, that's months of so. hard work! Oh. oh my god, hey, yes, not yes. coming back in, do you hear me? I hear End you. of discussion. I hear you. What was it? It was her project. You should have peed on it. Yay! Come on, buddy. Come on. There's a storm brewing. Oh my, I love him so much, I'm just seriously going to cry. Just because I love him. I'm going to cry because he's in my TV and I can't get him to, to hold him. <laughs> he's going to end up sleeping in their bed. She's going to warm it to him eventually. <laughs> He's actually watching it. How cute. Oh, I'm going to just a little bit. <laughs> or maybe he's going to split up from the woman and then he's going to end up alone with the doggy. Best day ever. None of your business. Go back to sleep. Just one night. One night only. Okay. I'm a good boy. One life. One life only. <laughs> It's forever, I'm telling you. You're not getting rid of him now. Okay. No, no, no. I was just about to say dogs learn how to play fetch really fast. Maybe not this breed. Mom. <laughs> no, he's going to show him how to do it. Oh. Could I get your number? I'm sure my husband will want to call you. She's not going to take the number. Finally! The dog's already been taken. I'm really sorry. It's going to make him so happy when you tell him. Well, you took a little longer than I would have liked, but at least you finally came round. Whoa! Hachi is big. <laughs> Look at his fur. It's so fluffy. Well, that's amazing. <laughs> Is he going to come on the train with you? No way. He's not allowed to. Hey, Chuck, we'll hold it up for a moment, all right? Go home. Go, 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 go. Go on home. Come on, Hutch. Doggo says no. Really oh, he's going home. Good boy. No, he's not. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Oh, did you get into trouble? He misses his dad. He doesn't like you because you didn't want him. <laughs> oh yeah, dogs only see in black and white. Do they not see any colours at all? Or just like, slight? You see slight colours. Oh, this is the worst one. <laughs> He's going to get the whole packet. Don't lie to yourself. He just wants to see his dada. Way, Good boy. He knows where to find him. Hey, how are you? <laughs> what are you doing here? That's amazing. My childhood dog would have done the same. It's actually mad when you think about it, how loyal dogs are. Three, two, one, now. Oh, I thought he was going to see him first. Hi. Yeah. Archie. <laughs> the grill's ready? Um, it's getting there, yeah. Okay. Yeah, nice to see you. Love you too. Um, yeah, that'd be... <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> see the boyfriend? People play instruments. Michael, do you love my daughter? Yes, sir. That's all he cares about. That's what you want to remember. In the bad days. Right. <laughs> Good advice, man. Hachi, this is Michael. Michael Hachi. Please to meet you. He thinks the steak's called Michael. <laughs> go! Hachi! Go get it! Go! Go get the ball! Wait, he still doesn't do fetch. Oh, I saw oh. that! <laughs> I saw that coming. <laughs> Even if I just toss it right here, he's not gonna get it? Huh? You're not? Hatch is like, I am not your slave. Go oh, get that ball. Why? What are you doing with it? It can't be ball. I'm Japanese, not yeah, American. Right? The Japanese, not American. That's funny. Well, if he's gonna fetch, yeah. for a very special reason. Oh, he's gonna end up fetching for a. What's it gonna be? He's gonna fetch for. He's gonna fetch and it's gonna save someone's life. I don't know how that'll happen, but it'll happen. I'm telling you. It's gonna save his life. If he fetches a ball. I'll see you here tonight. So go ahead. Go on home. Good boy. I don't, is he going to go home though? Yeah, and then he's going to come back just before he gets back. What do you think? Yeah. Oh, he's going to steal some food. <laughs> awesome. Archie. Nah, he knew he was going to get some. Oh my God. This is going to be the best. He's going to do the same every day. Brilliant. But how does a dog know what time it is? Or does he just have a feeling? Oh, they're getting married. How long's passed? This is years now. He'll be there somewhere. Can you believe they had her covered for 30 years? Isn't she beautiful? Yes, yeah, she is. He's not talking about the painting. The young soloist steps down stage, sings from La Boheme. Remember, your dog's missing. Go find him. Chop, chop. You don't have time for this. Oh my God, it's made me feel so sad that he's stuck somewhere. He's not been able to come and meet you. What are you doing here? Wait, what's happened? A skunk! <laughs> he's scared of the skunk. <laughs> oh, it's because he wants to protect you. Oh, that's so cute. He kept an eye on it for you the whole day so that he could protect you. What do skunks smell like? We don't have them here. Oh no, it's going to fart on you. Did it do it? <laughs> What's it smell like? Is it really that bad? <laughs> we got skunked. We got skunked. You want to come in with us? No, I'm going to pass. 
What are they washing in? What, were, what was on them? It looked red. Michael and I are having a baby. I'm pregnant. Oh wait, is that is Hatchie going to get jealous of the baby? The tension's not going to be on him anymore. Do they have a problem with Hatchie staying there while he's away? Because they seem like they're gossiping. You're overdressed. You have to be naked. Thing I might be able to do it now. <laughs> Bless. Bugger. This movie is going to go tits up, isn't it? What's going to happen? Someone's going to die and Hatchy. No, someone's going to almost die. Hatchy has to fetch to save him. Maybe it's the baby. Maybe something to do with the baby. So it's going too well. Everything's going too good. Something's going to happen that's bad. Let's find out. I don't want to find out, but let's. Aww. Hachi's feeling left out. He needs some attention. Hachi, come on. <gasps> He's mad at you. What is it? He's pissed because you showed your wife some attention instead of him. He loves you more than she does. Last chance. No. Bye. He's digging his heels in. He's a stubborn doggy. What? Why has he took the ball with him? Where's Hachi? <laughs> Everyone's used to seeing him every day. Right, go bring it back. Oh, that's it. That's what I wanted. But why? Well, I don't get it. What's happened? What's changed? I threw the ball, he brought it back. It was a fetch. I don't know. You keep the ball. He's not keeping the ball. He wants you to take it. I can't play now. I gotta go to work. I gotta go to work. Oh, is it so that... Because you take the ball and you have to give it back. You bring it back so he knows that you're coming... Oh my God, please tell me that's not why. He's scared you don't come back. So he's giving you the ball. And you have to take it back. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. Is that really what it's about? Okay, it's all right. Let's see if I can Why do you not think you're coming back? He senses something. What does he know? That's why he didn't want him to go in the first place. I secretly recorded his, uh, his marching band in a parade. I guess makes it the very first bootleg. <laughs> I'm not getting any of his jokes. <laughs> okay oh he's having a heart attack or something he's having a stroke maybe he's not <gasps> oh that's what the dog will sense that there's something not right with him Good. and he knows oh god and he's waiting for him to come home and he doesn't know if he's gonna come back that's not fair on the poor dog oh my god i feel awful for him that poor thing. He doesn't understand. You ready to go home? Yeah. Where is he? Where's the professor man? <gasps> did he not survive? This is how he did it. Sorry, I'll learn. Did he not survive? I thought it was just like a something small. What happened to him? Good boy, stay here, okay? I'll be back. Oh my God, I can't believe that the dog gave him the ball to make sure he came back with it. And he didn't come back with it. Oh, I know that wherever I go, others will punctually come forever. He's gonna wait for him there every day, isn't he? What's the dog thinking? That is the saddest thing. Oh my god. The poor dog's face. You do what you have to do. That poor dog. I can't believe it. The poor, poor dog. I can't believe you left him. And you didn't take his ball back. Was it a heart attack he had? What was it? Shh. 
No, you're not moving. You can't move because then... <sighs> what, a ha what about Hachi? God, I have the biggest lump in my throat. Come on, Hachi. You're gonna be with us now. Let's go. Come on. Oh, she's taking him. That's good. But I don't know if it's a good idea, the dog being away from the train station. Like... They should have known something was up when the dog didn't want to go with him to work. My God, the dog knew. He's so sad. But how long has passed now and he's still so sad? Hachi! Hachi, get God. back here! So wait, go find his dada. He just wants to see his dad again. Hey there, buddy. Coming to welcome us to our new home? Oh my god, he'll be so confused. He won't know what's happening. Does he still think it? Oh my god. Does he still think he might come back? Come on, our dog, boy. Come on, boy. Come on, our dog. Oh, this is so sad. You're good. You're good. It's good for you. Oh my God, he's still looking for him. He doesn't realize that he's gone. <laughs> what the hell do you do in this situation? What do you do? Because that's obviously where Hachi wants to be. I did not know this was going to be a sad movie. I think of him too. Every day. I don't think he got to meet his, the baby. If you have to go, that's okay too. <laughs> Good afternoon, Hachi. <laughs> He's walking his tail like <laughs> He was wagging his tail like he knew that he was coming back. <sighs> oh. I'm the one that found him, handed him over. Oh yeah? <laughs> you didn't find him. Nobody bothers him? Nah, we put up with him. He just does what he's doing. He just does what he's doing. <laughs> That's amazing. Hachi, don't mind. Thank you very much. Very nice. Very um, one without first, please. <laughs> Stay there. <laughs> well, well, I... Without you, dumbass. Kid and Derry sent you his lunch money. Huh? Wants me to buy you mm -hmm. treats with it. Hey, I don't. I don't really like this man. He's a bit of a dick. What are you doing with the money? I'm his executive. You should give it to the family. Give it to the baby. Oh, the baby's going to be the boy at the start that said that the dog was his hero. That that's the because he said my granddad's he my granddad's dog. Professor Wilson, sir. Mr. Professor, ah. <laughs> one sugar, two cream. <laughs> you saw my name in the article. <laughs> yes, I did. Twice. <laughs> <laughs> He's boss. <laughs> Medical expenses. We'll take a collection from the travelers, the vendors, and we will take care of it for you. That's amazing. Bless all you guys. I'm glad they're all looking after them. Oh my god, it's like the dog knows what he's saying. Oh my god. Oh my god! Don't make me cry again! 51? Was he only 51? It's 10 years. 10. Can you believe it? No. I thought it was 4. Oh, he's looking old. He looks really sad. Don't you dare pretend like you care about the dog because you was glad to see him go. I saw your face. But she's not once asked about the dog in the 10 years. 
If you cared about Hachi, you would have seen him ages ago, not 10 years later. <laughs> Don't you start. Oh, Hachi. He's, he looks like a massive teddy bear now. That has to be a different dog. Where did Grandpa find Hachi? Ronnie, actually, Hachi found your grandfather. I don't think she should get to sit and tell stories about Hachi when she's deserted him for 10 years. Yes, yeah, she had some grieving to do, but that's no excuse. Hachi was her dog too. I think he's going to die there. That's the spot he's going to die on. Oh, and they're going to bury him there and then he's going to have a little doggy grave. Oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit! Did he just die? I think he just died! <laughs> oh, this is the saddest movie! His whole life was pretty much waiting for. Waiting for him to come back. Come on, Hachi. Let's go. What? Did you seriously just replace Hachi? What? It's a true story. It's actually a true story. Oh my god! I don't believe it. Up. I had so this was all a true story. It actually happened. <sighs> I need to go see that statue. I feel like I have to go see it. This is amazing. Bloody hell. I wasn't prepared for that. Okay, I did not know this was how my day was going to go. That was the saddest movie ever. I think possibly sadder than Train to Busan, 100%. It's so sad because it's a dog and dogs can't express their feelings. So you're just trying to imagine what they're feeling inside. And that's why you get so emotional thinking about what the dog's feeling because you have to take on their feelings and their emotions. And I think I did that. I took on his cries. <laughs> It was so freaking sad. So it definitely was not like the homeward bound that I thought it was going to be and the dog talking and the dog telling us like the dog can tell us in its head what it was, the, the dog's tail. <sighs> that was too sad. <laughs> I'm just going to have to assume from now on whenever I watch a dog based movie that it's going to be, there's going to be tears. It's crazy that dogs can sense things and there's definitely something in that because i've had i've had a couple of dogs in my life and each one has shown some way of being able to sense something that we can't and 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 you know because they can smell like when before people take like an epileptic epileptic fit and stuff dogs can sense that and they can warn them and i don't know if it's like a smell or something but they they know they know things are happening before they even happen it's mental that dogs can do that i'm pretty sure other animals can too but dogs can communicate it to us the whole fetch thing just it that was it it got me i was done like he he didn't play fetch and I knew there was going to be something in that, but I thought he was going to have to like, someone was dying and he would have to fetch something to, to save them. I thought that's how that was going to play out, but it was like a million times better the way that he went and I'm, I'm, I'm going to set myself off again. He went and got the ball. He told his dad, don't go. And then he was like, I'm going to have to go. And then he went and got the ball to show him, please don't go. I need you to come back. Take the ball back to me. And he never took the ball back. I'm going to start crying. <laughs> this is just too much. It's too much. Oh, I hate it. That was such an amazing movie. I loved it, but I hate it. I think I I have something against Richard Gere and I don't know what it is. I've never been a fan of him. I think I watched him in... What have I seen him in? Pretty Woman. And I... That's probably where I don't like him from because I think that's the only movie I've seen him in. Possibly if it was another actor that played him. <laughs> but I don't know. He did He did fine. He was fine. I'm just like... 
I'm just mad. I'm mad at the movie because of what it did to me. <laughs> I wonder how many. When was this movie? Re when this movie re was released, I would like to see the graph of the sales of Akita dogs. It went. It probably went after that. Probably because everyone was like, "Well, if I'm going to have a heart attack, I want someone to tell me that I'm about to have one." And then anyone that bought an Akita dog and it started to behave differently that day they were probably like right I'm staying at home phone <laughs> phone in work uh, I can't come into work today oh yeah how come well because my dog is behaving weird <laughs> and that's exactly how that conversation would go and they would just stay at home all day every day what gets me is that so in my life I have had a number of dogs and family have had a number of dogs and I have known <laughs> many dogs in my life but those dogs have only had one family for their whole life and that's normally the case unless they end up with a shit family and then they get passed on but normally in most cases one dog has one family for their whole life so that's all they know and all they know is that they, they get left at home and they leave them and they don't know how long they're leaving them for. They just, they don't know. It's to like you have to, you have to think how a dog feels having only them in their life and being so in love with their owners and their, and being so loyal to them and like they leave them <laughs> every day to go to work and stuff. <laughs> Oh, I'm going wait, to wait cry again. Just because I feel sorry for the poor dog that has to get left at home and doesn't know what's happening. Because there's no way you can tell them. There's no way that you can be like, I'm coming back. And then sometimes you don't come back. And then, and then what? And then that's what happens. This movie's made. I can't believe that's a true story. That's just madness. But I, at the same time, I do believe it. I, there's a, I saw a video of, a, I, I think it was like a German Shepherd. And he was lying on someone's grave and he like would and he was crying the poor dog was like crying dogs are amazing they're like the best thing ever we dogs should own this planet they should be like they should make the decisions <laughs> the very important decisions should be made by dogs and i agree with that 100 percent all day every day okay well i was not expecting to cry today um the last movie i watched was dead men don't wear plaid and i i thought that was like best movie ever to put me in the best mood ever and this is best movie ever to put me in the the not the worst mood ever but it's definitely taken me down from that high that i was on <laughs> i just want to adopt like every single dog that is suffering in the world and i want to make them feel so much better and i want to just give them lots and lots of bozies lots of food lots of love lots of care i just want to make them happy i want to make every dog in the world happy and that would be my life goal when I am rich I say when because I'm going to manifest me being rich right now this is this is the plan when I am rich I am going to have a farm and on that farm I am going to have one cow just one because I feel like if I have more than one I won't be able to look after them because it'll be too much it'll be too much work so one cow and then I need chickens because I like eggs. I need chickens to feed me eggs. And then I'm going to have every single dog that like nobody, like if someone doesn't want the dog anymore, they'll just bring it to me and then I will take it on for them and I will feed it and I will love it and I will take it on walks every day and I will give it therapy if it needs therapy and I will I will have a private vet that will look after all I'm, I'm getting so excited because this is what my plan is going to be for when I retire. I'm gonna be the crazy dog lady with one cow. <laughs> the crazy many dog one cow lady. Yeah, you watch, it will happen. You will see. Okay, I feel like I need to go before I start to cry again because every time I think about the whole story with the ball I, I can feel my back of my eyes welling up and it's going to pour back out again so please please like this video for obvious reasons <laughs> because i need to be rich to look after all the dogs in the world so if you help me become rich then i will send you postcards of all the dogs if you just send me your address i will send you postcards and i will show to you that i have the many many dogs that i promised i would look after and also i will love you forever if you do everything you can to make child grow and i'm going to go thank you so much for watching i will see you in the next one goodbye Mwah.